the Great Zucchini as a 6-6 six, six here. Like right now in this board, what's better? Great Zucchini or Cornucopia? This is usually what our deck looks like come turn, you know, 10 or whatever. The Great Zucchini is real. I wish I could kill this one. Ah, uh, it's another dragon. Uh, Great Zucchini and then protect this one or whatever. Let's see. Ah, yes! <laughs> Blink Walker! <laughs> yes! Behold the wrath! Behold the wrath of the new card in this deck! <laughs> oh, someone feels bad! Someone feels horrible! <laughs> What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So here is a much anticipated deck. I think a lot of people have been waiting to see this deck. This is called Ramp to the Dragon Fruit. The idea is to ramp up. Ramp up means in this context getting as much sun as you can per turn uh, using a lot of cards that give you extra sun in this deck in order to get up to this card right over here, the Dark Matter Dragon Fruit. Now not only is this a huge card, it is quite expensive, it costs 8, but this makes the zombie tricks cost 6 brains more. So they're basically not going to be able to play any tricks ever, 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 ever. Uh, maybe, you know, they'll have like rocket science can take this out, but again, if you're getting this in early before turn 8, uh, they're they're not going to be able to play rocket science until you know a few turns afterwards and usually you're just going to be able to take over the game with your dark matter dragon fruit the idea is if you get this in early uh they'll take over the game and there's nothing they'll be able to do about it so the way that we're going to do that is by running ramp cards uh we are running four copies of this new card this is an environment uh, solar winds at the end of the turn if there's no zombies here make a sunflower here And the great thing is it makes the sunflower at the end of the turn that this lane late that this lane is empty And at the beginning of the turn that sunflower will already start giving you extra sun that turn So you can actually make more efficient plays than your opponent We are going to be trying this as an experiment running three copies of sunshroom uh, we are additionally running four copies of the Metapuddle Sunflower, which gives you extra sun each turn, and four copies of the Toadstool, that gives you extra sun each turn. Essentially, you could really play this uh, Dragon Fruit on turn five. I have done that before in the few games that I have tested this deck. Otherwise, everything else in the deck is a control, you know, really a control deck. That's what all these cards are for. I do run three copies of Shelleries. These are actually really important. In protecting your big cards especially your ramp cards and the dragon fruits themselves once they come onto the field so sticking one of these in front of your metal pedal or in front of your uh, toad perhaps uh, will ensure that they'll be able to survive that one extra turn in order that you'll be able to get the extra sun and uh, be able to play your dragon fruit once the dragon fruit is out also it is nice to be able to stick these in front of the dragon fruit so the dragon fruit doesn't get confronted by big minions uh, I've decided to run a couple copies of the Leaf Blower. This really could protect your ramp cards uh, on turn 4. It's really nice to have 4 drops since you're typically skipping from turn 2 to turn 4. Uh, also, if this is played in the Solar Winds, it will bounce the zombie out of there, further making things uh, good for you. Anyway, I hope that you enjoy. This deck uh, is pretty effective. This will definitely be a lot of fun. I really hope we can uh, play this deck uh, well enough that it'll actually be a really, really high tier deck in the game since this is a really, really hype deck. And this is kind of one of the main ways to uh, really get Dragon Fruit, really to play this card in a deck. So here it is. It's Ramp to the Dragon Fruit. Dun, 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 dun. I hope that you enjoy. Yes, well, I can see to low rank guys anyway a lot. The season reset's supposed to be the next few days here. It's supposed to be, I think they were sending out.
get out of here. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Leaf blower value. It's got the goggles on. And the little, it was like this little propeller. No, that doesn't matter. He doesn't realize. <laughs> and he realizes his mistake. You know what? Just because that guy was, uh, uh, I'm going to count that as a win. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't realize if you plumber the, the the dude if you plumber the sunflower it just makes another sunflower the next turn it does nothing that plumber oh the saddest plumber ever give that plumber a better crack give him a better but give him a better bungee cord uh, The first game was just the guy conceded while we were. <laughs> just, it was kind of hilarious the way he conceded. Very premature, but it was, you know. We were making fives on that turn, so it was by no means the beginning of the game. Dang, it's my Spirus, man. Quit messing with my Spirus. I almost hope this doesn't block. Unless there's probably the next shot will end up doing more than two. I'll. I, I might use this next turn. We're making enough sun to use this together with something. Ooh, here we go. All right, this is the okay, cake. So if I play this on turn five, turn six, we're going to be making...
try to win this turn. Wow, Zombot would be quite good. <laughs> this is going to be turn 9 coming up, right? This was turn 8. Uh, if he blocks really luckily here, this is 8 damage. Uh, no, that's game. <laughs> he would have to get evaporate, and then he would have 1 health left, and then he could have Zombotted there. Anyway. I guess that we shouldn't have played the Spires then. Alright. Anywho. Give that man a Zombot. And that is exactly, exactly how this deck is supposed to work. Again, we, we got it in on turn 7, which getting it on turn 7 is still worth it. Once you have Dragon Fruits on the field, once you have the 1 on the field, you're kind of like very far ahead. Little baby dragon fruit. I will definitely give him the boot. Alright, let's do this. 
Yeah, I could play this next turn here. No one cares. No one cares. Still a good card. Uh, have I seen the new video with the card rarities? Yes, I've reacted to that. I will put it on. I better put it on YouTube quick so people stop asking me that. <laughs> All right, Brainana might be a play. Toad might be a play. Toad actually ramps to Dragon Fruit for next turn, so I would love to play the Toad here. The Toad actually kills the Cosmonaut, or whatever you call it. I don't know what his name is. The Moonwalker. He's a dancing guy. The, this does kill. Oh, I hope he plays a card here. I want to gobble something with the Toad. Give this man. Come on, man. Oh, Jenny. All right. Anyway. Uh, all right. One, two. Buckle my shoe. 
This is okay. I wonder how hard we mulligan for that for the metal pedal. Or for a second ramp guard. This works on one. I like keeping this. Okay, do I get rid of the six? Okay, I'll get rid of this. That's advanced. Oh, <laughs> do we do this? Do we keep both of these? All right, let's see what happens. We're keeping both of these. This deck's kind of pay to win. <laughs> well, there's only four legendaries. Only four. It's only dragon fruit. What about star fruit? We could have ran star fruit, but I, I'm really actually the most recent YouTube video at the time of this recording was the onion beans one and I'm I said during that video that I would probably take out the star fruit if I got another onion rings and the truth is I got two two more star fruits and I added both of them in and it was a good move hard mulligan the mul I don't really know how to mulligan this deck yet we're gonna find out you know we've been doing so far so so good we've really been dominating I'm gonna, again, how much do you mulligan for the ramp? This is a ramp and a control deck. Really, every ramp has to be a control deck. It's the way it goes. And this is actually a really good pickup. Now, the, let's just think, the Beastie are remove its nerf. I see, I don't like playing this on an empty field. They don't really have a good turn four ramp anyway. I think I'm gonna pass. I think we're gonna wait and we're gonna play, we're gonna spam these later. He could cover this up, he, you know, he either has, uh, what's it called, Total Eclipse, and the crazy one is Moon, I don't know if people are going to be playing uh, Moon Z, or Planet Z, or Moon Z, whatever it's called. I don't want this getting covered up by a Total Eclipse, though. I put in Starfruit, I took out a couple of the cards, it happens to be once you Onion Ring a Starfruit, the Starfruit single-handedly could just, like, totally take over the game. Um. Ooh, what do we do here? He could have a lightning bolt. You know, half of his powers are lightning bolts. I might just mog this. I feel like this is going to get too strong. Kind of anything I do. I mean, this will absorb his lightning bolt. Well, let's just mog this card. and do want, It'll allow us to play the... Uh, the solar winds already. Headstone Carver. Not bad. I really love a mag. I can't turn into a two drop. Sunstream doesn't help. It, it does. It does. We'll we'll see. I think it, it will because again it'll add one turn. We haven't gotten Sunstream yet, so I don't even know how you can say that. You have to play, you can't just play Sunshroom on turn two, because then it just ends up dying. You gotta, when you're ramping, you gotta see exactly what am I gonna do next turn, is this a good ramp play or not. There's another Cool Beans. We've got a lot of answers here. A hand of answers. The first thing does go behind here. Now we can go three and another Solar Winds. Let's see what happens. <laughs> is the music sound here? Starch Lord is OP. Two, one, and two. Again, the first sunflower dying is no problem because it'll we'll just make another one next turn. The ramp is real. Now let's see if we can get something. Plumbering, good play. Oh, this thing will be easy to take care of there. Little one guy. Uh, I'm kind of confused about that. May oh, he didn't like the three damage as opposed to the two. Anyway, so we'll make one. Solar wind still exists. We'll try to cover this. We're making six this turn. Spirus. Oh, I would like to freeze a gravestone. It's just, I'm just in the mood. With rarity changes, will I make a full legendary deck, maybe? Ooh. The Spirus value is real. We can play all these, actually. This is, this is strike through. 
And this is a cool bean. All right, that's fine. It's nice developing these cards. Developing these cards right now. The kitchen sink. I'll, I'll look at that eventually. I'm not going to do it today. Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. <laughs> More dancers. Give this man a flamenco. Ugh. The ramp is not real. No, the ramp is still real. Die. How are we out of cards already? We have three cards to as well. The, all of our cards are sitting on the board right now in these environments, and they're not adding much value. Come on. Give us something. Ooh, Toad. Yes. Yes. Where is dragon fruit? Give this man a dragon. All I wanted for my birthday was a dragon. We have flamenco. It's gonna get blocked though, probably. Come on, man. All I wanted for my birthday was a dragon. Do I use this here? Yeah. The cool beans. Just gonna stay alive. Staying alive. Oh. Uh, I think we'll do the more expensive one. I don't know, this does gobble a lot of things later. We don't have a dragon fruit. In fact, if we just play cool beans, we'll have enough for the dragon fruit already. Oh, I don't know. I haven't seen any gravestones. I don't see any impending ones. Maybe he has, you know. I think let's go with this. Is it, it's just the one. Does the four. It's four more damage this turn. Maybe for the four damage, it's worth it. All these, not gonna do it. Yeah, I think let's just keep the pressure going. Where is dragon fruit? Give this man a dragon. Top deck dragon. Is it my birthday today? No. It is not. <laughs> We're on a secret mission. He's gonna kill the, uh, the toad. <laughs> See you later, dancer. That was a good play. It's kind of a good card with dancers. Ha. Uh, more ramp. All right, this is turn seven, but we're making nine. Come on, dragon fruit. Give that man a dragon. A dragon. Give that man a dragon. Yeah, I should make a... Uh, anyway. When's the next GTA? I'm, I'm going to be doing it after streams now. I'm not going to do it today. I'm not prepared for it. I'll, I might do it by the day stream too, though. So keep... Keep, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll be posting the... The new schedule, but in the meantime, I will be switching back to 7:30 to 9:30. I'll give Tryhard a little host, just to be nice to the other streamers. What is this garbage? I wonder if we protect the three attack with this, as opposed to being greedy right now. That eh, looks pretty good. I like the three strike through. Makes me feel warm and cozy inside. Well, he's just gonna he's gonna kill it no matter what he gets here. So maybe we should just put the pedal to the metal. Uh, yeah. We should have like nowhere to put the dragon fruit. Yeah, we'll put it here. From lane four. Where is the dragon? The ramp is broken. <sighs> Stop caking me. It's not fun. The cake is a lie. Okay. Please don't block. Yes. Two more damage. Okay, now we have a million. <laughs> you know how many sunflowers? We're gonna have four sunflowers here. Where is the dragon? I want the dragon so badly. Brainana wouldn't be a bad pickup here. Okay, we just have a lot of sunflowers. There's no card draw with Rose. Huh, maybe we should have some. Ah, applesauce. Don't mess with the apples. <laughs> We're making 12. Maybe this deck need, just needs a cornucopia or two. That sounds good. This is probably going to be a rat, so I'm going to do this here. Don't mess with the rat. No. Ah. Applesauce would have been good in lane one. Can make a Starch Lord deck. Yeah, I'll consider it. Where is the dragon? <laughs> I'm kind of not worried about us winning this game. Really, all of the cards we have are kind of good late game. Yes! The dragon! The dragon is here! Oh, we're gonna put this right behind the sunflower. I'll take it. I love the dragon. The dragon's my favorite. Actually, we should really go face with the dragon. <laughs> I like saying dragon with a... I think that's a Welsh accent. Ah, 
Alright, now is one cost tricks cost seven. I think we're pretty good to go here. He would have to light no, no, that's game. <laughs> that's guaranteed lethal. The dragon is guaranteed lethal. <laughs> yes. <laughs> top deck madness. How come no one does the top deck emote when I top deck madness something? Give that man some top deck madness in this game. It was just a matter of time until we got the dragon. Wonder if I should add some more expensive cards into this deck. I should remove some of the garbage. We haven't seen Sunshroom yet. It has not even come up. I want to wait till it comes up. I wonder if having two more just cornucopias in this deck would be good. What would I take out? What has been useless? I think the Spiruses have been useless. I'll take out a Spirus and I'll put in a Cornucopia. How about that? I don't think anyone's gonna complain. <laughs> Let's put in one Cornucopia. How about that? Freaking dragon. I haven't really pl played against any fast decks yet. Okay, I'll take out you and I'll put in one too. Alright, now it's a real ramp deck. Instead of Cornucopia, the thing that can really protect the dragon fruit on 9 is Great Zucchini. I think because of the lanes here, the Great Zucchini is actually going to be better. They can't play tricks, so they got to play minions. Oh yeah, this is the this is the <laughs> the insight of the century. Listen, guys, listen. They can't play tricks. They've got to just play minions, right? Great Zucchini is the answer. That's the way it's done. Give that man some zucchini. Zucchini is better. Plus, you end up having lanes clogged with the sunflowers and anything. Yeah, Great Zucchini's better, guys. Rose. I love Rose. Rose is bae. Okay, let's do this. Ah. Oh, do we keep two? <laughs> I'll keep one. In our starting hand. Haha, <laughs> we will see Sunshroom in action. Um, this isn't good against Boog. A 3 2. I don't agree. We can get something better. Ooh, two four. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect. That's a good starting hand. Here we go. Pass. I, again, we're not gonna play this into uh, just you know. If he has the electric ball, those and fine. It's actually not bad. Let's see what he does here. If he, I will just want him to commit a gravestone. That would be aerobic instructor. What would we do? No. It's either again. Squirrel, rat, conga, newspaper. Useless. Uh, okay, let's think. Where does the dragon fruit's best lane? Mm, I wanna. Eh, it doesn't really matter. Just thinking very far ahead, too. Man, I wonder if there's a calculation in terms of which of these lanes this should go in, but. This is a good. Again, this is a good use of this card now. He might go. I don't know. Is he gonna go face? No, he's gonna go after that. That's fine. He can't take this out. We're at least going to be able to get a metal pedal on the on the field right now. Yeah, at least. Uh, this actually... Oh, no, the one damage didn't matter, right? This thing heals. Now he needs a three. I mean, he's going to have to Wrath or Lightning Bolt this thing in order for it to do anything. Now, this is at two costs. This is either going to be a Kanga, a Newspaper, a Rat, or a Squirrel. So I believe we want to keep that alive. I would like to ramp up ASAP, that's fine. Does not have a way of killing the Sunnier Shroom. He's going to be doing all these little bits of damage too. He's actually just going to charge our block meter, which is fine. Uh, okay, now we're making, this Sunnier Shroom is making two sun a turn. For all those haters who did not like the Sunnier Shrooms in this deck, look what's happening now. Four, five, six, seven. We are almost home, you guys. We are very close to the ramp here. I could actually Solar Winds. gonna chickening probably which is totally fine that is totally fine with me solar winds I think here actually so I'm gonna put a zombie down there there's no way I'm doing that I'm gonna go with these two I want to keep this alive. Well, I'm not putting that there. It's probably going to be chickening. Man, Brainana that turn would have been so good. 
think let's do this. And we'll kill that one. This will still this will die in the jigming, but it's worth it. In fact, if we get freeze, it actually won't die in the chickening. That's fine. So he kills these two. That's all right. This will make a sunflower. Just got to get that dragon as fast as possible. So now we're making. Yeah, we'll use the freeze. Keep this three one alive. I think that's worth it. Ha! -ha great zucchini. The follow up. So again, this just did the overshoot damage to our face, the two damage. But uh, now we're making. Um, making seven again. Man, we made seven that turn. Wait, and we're making seven again. Dang. Uh, uh. The dragons are good. The dragons are so good to me. I'll probably end up. Wow, flamenco. Harsh. Flamenco, flamenco, and that's it. They don't really need it. I mean, go to fight. Huh. We're gonna be making a whole lot of sun here. We're making a whole lot of sun. I do want, okay, so again, seven. This was turn five. So we need six, seven, eight. We just need two ramp guards surviving. We need to preserve this. Kind of would be nice. We need to prevent this. Maybe the two damage hitting us is good. I don't want him flamencoing us again. Let's do this. Do I go to fight this or do I save that for next turn? Well, I can't go to fight with something. Uh, I think this is worth it. There we go. Now I can actually Great Zucchini. If he actually plays a big minion, I'm going to Great Zucchini it. If not, I'm going to Dragon Fruit. We actually, this is a great, this is actually a really nice situation. We're going to be making nine sun this turn. Uh, this turn six, we're going to have two sunflowers and a metal petal. The dragon fruit is only in lanes one or five, so actually the dragon fruit is not ideal. So we have two, so if he goes for the trick, we're gonna go with the dragon fruit. If he goes for the minion, we'll go with the zucchini. It's if he goes halfway, then we're just gonna we're probably gonna go with the dragon fruit. The dragon. Oh, <laughs> the fail is real. Uh, wait, is the dragon better here? I think the dragon's actually still better, and the little one one goes here. Uh, even though he played three minions, the one ones are really. Eh, let's go with the dragon. The dragon. Well, Grace Zucchini next turn. This is a good dragon. This is a fun dragon. He's gonna kill the metal pedal, which is fine, because then the second dragon can go here. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Backup dancers. Ah, kill a sunflower. Yes, the dragon is actually much better in this lane, so this will not make another sunflower. We can actually stick the dragon behind here. That's fine. <laughs> another dragon! Oh no, you only make eight this turn? Oh, I forgot about that. Oh yeah, so we have to dragon now. Ah, so many dragons. Too many dragons. What is this gonna be? Whatever it is. No one cares. Dragon value. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna do two damage to us. That's nice. Now we have two dragons. Two dragons. <laughs> what? My first day of kindergarten is tomorrow. Don't say that. That's not nice. All right. Now he can't play tricks ever, 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 ever. So he's gonna have to play minions. So Great Zucchini is amazing. Even though this actually only has one health left. Come on, man. Give that man a. Gravestone. Oh, great Zucchini doesn't work on Great. No! <laughs> He's trying to chip, chip me. That's not very nice. Where's the most damage this turn? Six, three. Hold on. Three and six. <laughs> 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 da 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 I feel like I want to save the Great Zucchini. I think we're just going to do this, this. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Die. Behold the power of the dragons. Do one damage? Where? To the dragon? 
He might do it to the dragon. Okay, that'll probably... Well, wait, if we get... Did we get Weed Whack yet this game? I don't remember. Ah! Weed Whack Lethal! I'm gonna whack this guy! This guy is whack! His hat, whack! His little, his little flower is whack! Boogaloo is whack! Everybody's whack! Got him with the whack! The way I like it. It's about 550 total. 30 cost guard feast? Yes, exactly. Ooh, ooh, I like what I see. Um, this protects the, huh. Well, it's in this lane, so it'll be, yeah. Ah, whack. <laughs> All right, I don't know what, okay, are there any good, who knows, maybe someone can play mini ninja on one, you never even know in this meta. Everything's changed, it's so unpredictable. Here we go. I should actually kill some of these. A volume mixer. Die volume mixer. Okay. Kill steam. I actually might have some apps here that are absorbing some of my some of my internet. So we'll kill those. Really I'm using zero percent of my uh do I play we do have the RAM for next turn and again Two costs, I don't know, there is the sneaky one, and then there's the hardy one. The hardy one is horrible. Well, there's two hardy ones. I'm gonna risk it. It's worth it. If we can get the battle pedal here in next turn, definitely worth it. It's a metal pedal behind a sunflower. It's a lot of ramp. We have the big cards already. Sometimes you just gotta put the, put the pedal to the metal, if you know what I'm saying. That's definitely what this deck does. All right. There is some frozen beans. Justin, that's gonna be good against great against Neptuna. Who is that gonna be good? Now, this is a three cost. So again, what what are we working with here? A smelly zombie. It's not line dancing zombie because he wouldn't put it in that lane. Um, landscaper. I think this is fine. Landscaper. You have a big nose, thank you. That's nice, it's actually extra shiny today because of the light. I don't like the shiny nose actually. Give this man a better camera angle. Why is my nose so shiny? Give this man a less shiny nose. Come on, man. And that's fine. This could get whacked next turn, but ooh, we got another one. Hey, hey, wow. What is he gonna do, weed spray? Three to the one, to the one, to the three. I like. Um. Um. I think I want to save this. He's probably just gonna Rolling Stone or Weed Spray this, which is okay. Well, we'll take it out later. But he's gonna be spending a couple. <laughs> he's gravestoning that. Does this count as there not being a zombie here? I wonder. Is this gonna make a sunflower? Again, if there's no zombie here, there's technically not a zombie. I wonder if this is going to make a sunflower. I am curious. What's your bet, guys? Call your... No. Man, come on. I wanted to see it. Never mind. It's irrelevant. Oh, well. Come on, man. Uh, I wanted to know that. I was curious, too. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Make a gravestone, non gravestone play. We have this. Okay, the non gravestone play is real. This is gonna be a ugh, useless. I wonder if that's gonna be a line dancing zombie. Oh, uh. Uh. Three to the one, to the one, to the three. If it's a line dancing zombie, maybe. Well, it's gonna be frozen anyway. It's definitely this play. Wait, no, maybe it's this one. Because this line dancing zombie is going to nerf it. He can't, well, he can't weed spray. He might have a rolling stone. This actually might be worth it because then we're going to be making, uh, he might have another rolling stone. It's so funny, but don't want, I have dragon fruit in hand. This is actually, wait, we made six, seven, eight. Yeah. I think that's actually the play. Is that a surprise? Oh, uh, no, nah, we're close. Never mind. Oh, he didn't go for it! Yes, the dragon is here. 
Behold the dragon. He didn't want to. He didn't want to mess with this. If we would have put this here, we wouldn't have grown a sunflower. Since we would have killed this. Yes. Ah, you don't know how a rose ramp works anymore, do you, son? Do you, son? The dragon. Behold the dragon. The dragon will eat everybody. And we're gonna get the great zucchini. This should be able to protect this lane pretty well. Here's that. Behold the dragon. Yes, wow. Our opponent passed on five brains that turn. I bet it's going to be Monster Mash, but now even a one cost trick costs seven, so that's it. The dragon will get the value here, will get the splash damage, and this will lead right into Great Zucchini for next turn. If we see a Gravestone, we're going to, we have the free, again, the, the bean, the cool beans left in our hand, which is just so good. Gotta love that cool beans. All right. The ramp value, so now we're making nine, which just gives us so many plays. I almost wish he would play some gravestones. There's a gravestone. I want to keep this alive, so we're gonna cool beans. Three to the one, to the one, to the three. I kind of want to keep this. Uh, okay, let's do it like that. I like this rampy card too. That's frozen. That's pretty good. This is a good deal too. Could have gone with this one. And um, the question is, do I do I play this card? What if this is a rodeo garg? He's gonna be able to move it away anyway. He can move this away. I think we're good. I think we're good. We're actually ramping extra next turn. It's just landscaper, but he can play. Weed spray anything. You can't, you can't even play Rolling Stone. I forget about that. <laughs> Just nerfing all my cards, though. That's not nice. It's not very nice. Stop playing Gravestones now, please, dude. It's getting annoying. I could just play the Great Zucchini as a 6 6 here. Like right now in this board, what's better? Great Zucchini or Cornucopia? This is usually what our deck looks like come turn, you know, 10 or whatever. The Great Zucchini is real. Wish I could heal this somehow. Ha! Ah, it's another dragon. <laughs> Making so much sun this turn. Uh, great zucchini and then protect this with whatever. I don't know. We'll see. Ha ah, ha! Yes! Ha <laughs> Plank Walker! <laughs> yes! Behold the wrath! Behold the wrath of the new card in this deck! <laughs> oh, someone feels bad! Someone feels horrible! <laughs> <laughs> Let's keep this alive. Why not? This one's actually gonna die, so we just have a great lane for us to stick dragon number two. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll have one of these zombies left. The splash damage is real. <laughs> yes! Yes! It's so good. Uh uh. Another dragon! <laughs> Maybe this. <laughs> That was so great. That was so good. Uh, oh, <laughs> the Mog is good. The Mog is real. <laughs> Did I do this? Uh, 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 <laughs> and have one attack, please. No, God, Chimney Sweep. You're annoying. And, uh, happens to be most of our strong cards are blocked right now, but that's okay. Three to the one to the one. It's nice having the dragons really touching each other so the splash damage can really open up the second one. The six attack is so important here, but we actually still did not win. I don't know what this guy's going to do about it. Another plank walker could get him back in the game. Bounce, yes. Give us back, uh, that's actually good for us. No, I got some. Yes, now we got a new. It's just like a free card. We have a new card to protect one of our dragons with. That's nice. And we're making twelve suns turn. La la la. <laughs> Give this man a crack screen. <laughs> Behold the wrath of the dragons. What is he gonna do here? Oh, it's a knight. Yay. Yay. Knight value. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, he almost killed one. It's really nice having the team ups. This is why I'm running the the sunnier shrooms. First of all, okay, we've you've, we've seen the second use out of it. Just be able to put in front of your dragons, and also the um, the. Also, the Shellery is, is good to put in front of it. Like, the Shellery actually would have ended up... No, it wouldn't have ended up killing the knight there. But anyway, you get the point. The, the Shelleries are really important putting in front of your metal pedals and stuff like that, too, just to make them survive that extra turn. <laughs> All right, 6-0. Ah, I like the Great Zucchini. The Great Zucchini saved our Tuchuses there so badly. Give that guy a new Tuchus. That guy could use one. I think we just ripped him a new Tuchus. Yeah, YouTube intro, probably. <laughs> she says OP. <laughs> you guys are going to say all these decks are OP, but again, if all the zombie decks are OP and all the plant decks are OP, that means that neither of them are OP. It means that they're all balanced, because as long as both sides, as long as there's more than one deck that's OP and it's on both sides and stuff like that, there's no problem. I got a horrible hair day. Why is this hair sticking up? I'm just going to ignore it. Okay. Um... Ba -da -da -da. I haven't seen a lot of Immortitia in general, especially since set two. <sighs> Anything good on turn one, two, three? Eh, I could play it slow. Okay, you know what? That's good. It's not necessary though. All right. Let's see, this is opening some stuff up. All right, tell what, it's a good control hand. We're gonna ramp late. We don't see the dragon fruit or an early game ramp, so let's not try to over mulligan for you know. Even if I would see the dragon fruit, it could be I would. Um, that's again, good control play on turn one. Uh, even it's probably just gonna be a pet deck and more such a pet deck. Uh, if I would see like the dragon fruit in our hand and like kind of different steps of the ramp, I might have even gotten rid of the cool beans to try to make something. But you know what, you can play this like a control deck too. Click bees good. I think click bees are going to be amazing. I don't know when those are coming out, but I think that is going to be like really good. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to combine that with other cycling decks, especially with Moonbeam. Are they the same class? Anyway, and then you just keep on cycling through your deck, and that would just be insane. Woo! Giving us cards. I don't know if that's good. I think actually this this deck really does kind of rely on specific stuff. <laughs> Do I have a good turn four? See, I don't have a good turn four play. Really getting the extra one this turn is, is kind of useless. I wonder if sacking this is better. Uh, what's better? Getting two two? Or if this is one extra damage. This is cheaper. I have a three drop here. I think I'm actually going to keep, since I have the cool beans, which is a three attack minion, it's kind of similar to this one. I think we're going to do the applesauce. Is Click be Mega Grow? I remember it's Mega Grow or Smarty. I remember, but it's gonna be good. What is this? Freeze a freeze deck? Yeah. Well, you can do freeze rows. This will this will add a lot of value to freeze rows. Oh, <laughs> this is just such a great card in general. Happens to be besides for yeah gravestone. Besides for Rose having having had no answer to gravestones for like except for like Shellery. There's a gravestone. Okay, let's think what we got in the box here. We have electrician. Um, no. Um, we have electrician. Ah, oh, there's so many smarty ones. What if it's a rat though? I don't want this trading with a rat right now. Maybe I'll just do this. I have to freeze this gravestone. I don't know, just because it's turn three, I have to freeze this thing. What am I afraid of? What's the worst case scenario in a turn three gravestone here? I mean, gentleman zombie would be kind of rough. I'm going to do this. We actually have one of these leaf blowers in our hand right now, so if this ends up being too bad... So that doesn't matter. It's four damage this turn. It's a 2-2 two -two on the board, essentially. I'm kind of happy I didn't freeze that, because then, then again, I would have played... We're going to get extra sun now. We can blow whatever we want. I hope our opponent makes a... You know, even if we make a gravestone play, then we can play the, the bean freezer next turn. It'll probably be better than this 2-2. Two -two. It's a fugly 2-2. Two -two. That's pretty good. Mini inter... They're, well, they're really like the jade golems from Hearthstone. <laughs> sorry for... Sorry for bugging them. Ooh, pass. Oof. 
teleport something in. Did we blow this? Is this better on the board for us? Want to freeze and we'll freeze it the next time. I don't know which is better here. I want to make a play here. I don't think this lane's gonna. I think it's gonna be beam me up inside. I wonder if blowing this is good though. I mean, this is an extra stat. It's more on curve. There's gonna be maybe gravestones to freeze later. Uh, let's do it. That's fine. I hope I don't regret that. That electrician might be useful later, but mm, it's a card off the field. Uh, something which is useless because again we're just gonna get this thing back now is have she has a bonus attack kind of still useless because it's <laughs> this was a really good summoning by the way three attack it's almost rarely has that much attack but again now what now what are you gonna do nibble nibble we'll still get a sunflower next turn it's not a good it's not a good play and ooh, it's in an environment no this is minus six? Dang, taking it down. That was a good play. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Wow, that really messed up our, we were gonna, man, we were gonna get a turn six dragon fruit there. That really messed us up. Great play by that guy. It's paparazzi, pa -pa paparazzi. Boo -doo 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 -doo. This is the electrician again, I bet. Paparazzi, paparazzi, booty dee booty dee booty boo, boo doo 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 doo. That one's the best bonus attack. Let's do this. We'll freeze that gravestone just in case it's not. I don't think it's a point. We're gonna save this for protecting something coming up. Yeah, it's just a bonus attack. No one cares. No one cares about the well. Like nibble or lunch. Lunchbox doesn't hurt. Nibble again. This will just trade. So this is just like a, essentially a three for one right now. You get the two two on the board, but that trades with that paparazzi. Paparazzi. So I haven't even thought about using paparazzi since that too. I don't. There hasn't really been that many good tricks. There is one actually, a really good hardy one. Maybe I should make a paparazzi deck just because you can protect your paparazzi's really well. All right. In all. This is turn six. We, we should be. Uh, there's no reason we, we won't get the the dragon next turn. The dragon value. I think we'll just gobble this thing. Gobble, gobble. Why not? Beam me up. Helicopter. We'll still get it if he helicopters. And we'll just dragon here. Should I set this up here? Uh, I might get nibbled. Nah, eh, let's, let's save it. Do a video on kitchen sink. Anyway, well, those cards, those are like, that's very advanced. The cards are way gonna come. <laughs> why are you, why are you nibbling that? Now what are you gonna do? He's gonna do beam me up bonus attack. Why would you nibble that? That doesn't make any sense though. <laughs> it's gonna make another sunflower, you dolt. So now we actually are making nines. This is turn seven. We're gonna be making nine sun this turn. We will get the sunflower in the empty lane. I'll accept friend requests in, I don't know, soon. <laughs> We're not gonna have time for 10 games. This might be the last one, we'll see. This will probably, well, I'll do a couple more maybe. Ah, I messed with the dragon. The dragon is too good. Is this gonna be a rat? Piece of rats, you ratty little rat. Uh, I think keeping this alive right now, like this, is good. And it's oh, oh, it's that huge electrician. I forgot about him. I forgot about you. Oh, wow, it's a really good thing we put that shellery there. I totally forgot about the electrician. No, oh, that's not a good play, because Electrician's just going to... Okay, so he killed that. All right. I think he should be getting to work on the Dragon Fruit already. I would have done the bonus attack in lane two, but... Hey, that's his call. He didn't like the uh, he didn't like the Toad there. We're actually going to still ramping up. Now, he can't play tricks, so this is going to have to be the minion turn, and we have a great Zucchini in hand. This is the wonderful combo. 
<laughs> this actually <laughs> this actually hunts down that ah second dragon let's see what he's got I mean it's been a lot of gravestone minions a lot of science zombies and stuff but no the great zucchini is good folks the great zucchini is insane we don't actually have to we could we don't actually have to great zucchini here <laughs> actually we actually could drag in here it's great zucchini better I feel like we want to use Great Zucchini on a big card. This one, we, we don't, we're we not worried about this at all. Let's just do this. Can't play any tricks. We'll hit him for six all the same. We can always protect the first one with the dragon from the first one protects the second one now. So we'll do six damage. Yeah, that's a good play. Obviously, uh, there's no one cost tricks in this world. <laughs> there's not even any, there's not even any 12 cost tricks. The minimum a trick can cost right now is 13. Yeah. When was the last time I run Shellery? Shellery is really, again, I've been using more, I've been over valuing Shellery more and more. Now, right now, with these dragon fruits on the field, the Shellery is like the card. And yeah, another one bites dust. Another one bites dust. <laughs> Too many dragons for him to deal with. <laughs> what did I take out for the two zucchinis? I took out one Sunshroom and one Spirus. I realized the Spiruses were, again, they're useful. It's nice to have a one cost control card, but they're less useful than we thought. They end up being very dead at the end of games. The, the Shalleries are not dead, and the, you know, the other one cost cards are really not at the end of the game. Spires is more for the beginning of the games. Just so you don't get killed by Toxic Waste Imp, and I don't even know that. Pear Paradise with Molokale. I don't think Pear Paradise works well with Molokale, to be honest. If you put a second one, but the thing with Molokale is you gotta be... The turn before Molokiel, you gotta put minions on the board, particularly a Pine Clone. If you play Pear Paradise, your minions are gonna wither that you're not gonna have anything left to Molokiel. I think that's that's a... I don't think that works. Whatever it was, the, did Ginza put out the, the rarity changes too? I, I, I reacted to the KTT one, I don't know, there's a different one too. Ooh, here's the Wombo combo. It, typically, Brainanas are not good against... Uh, against this hero. This is a great starting hand. Three twos are very good against the Hardy. I love this Apple Saucer card. Just the, it's very similar to Flaming P. It's, you know, the stats are better. It's not a P, so it's a fruit instead. That In that way it's worse. It does become Strike Through late in the game, which a three three damage Strike Through is pretty good. It's just that the Solar Class has a decent two drop. So significant. And we got the answer to that. <laughs> this is why we're running these one drops in this deck. It's not for the late game. It's just to control these crazy guys. You're just mini ninja on one. Come on, man. Does Fry know about the new Afterlight trait? Can someone explain that to me? I did see that highlighted, but we didn't. We couldn't tell if it was anything different. the The text seems to say the same thing. So you guys want to tell me about the Afterlife thing? Uh, let me know in the chat. I would love to hear more about that. Do you think Intergalactic Warlord and Firefighter Zombie would work? No, but with why not just mix up Gravedigger? <laughs> I did a deck like that today. It wasn't so. Actually, I don't think we actually ever pulled off that combo, but it was. That's just because we were so far ahead. If we would actually have an opponent that was competitive, we would have needed to do that. It never stops coming back. Is Octo Infinite now? Wait. Is Octo is Ghost the same thing? Does Ghost just keep coming back? If that if so, then Ghost is a good Is that already or is that what it's gonna be in the future? Let me know. Ah, uh, this is fine. Do I do this here? 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 Where does this go? We wanna protect this this one with the sunflower. No, it came back one. What do you mean it comes back until it's dead? It's always dead. I mean until you transmogrify it. It's endless until it's killed? I'm so confused. You guys are being so obscure. They come back as a token. So it doesn't work. I don't know why people think that afterlife means they're going to keep on coming. Oh, super. Nice. Good play, denying us the ramp. So we'll, we'll weed back. We have a weed back answer. Oh, this would have been a good reason to put it here, just in case the player on super. That's interesting. Weed whack and another one. 
this guy is whack. Man is whack. I think I actually have to weed whack this one. So let's do it like this. <coughs> there we go. We have another solar winds. It's a lot. It is a lot of solar. You know, solar winds doesn't. It just gives you the ramp. It gives you. I guess the sunflowers are good at protecting things sometimes. Smoke bomb. Okay. This man is <laughs> in the water lane. It's a lot of damage. Ooh, gotta watch out for this Neptune. Actually, we're you're even. We're actually totally even. That's nice. Plus our board is way better. And we're making more sun this turn. Four, five, uh. Okay. Uh, it doesn't, we're not going to be able to utilize it at all. Utilize it. Be able to utilize it. This guy's just going face. The blind face value. I wonder what Neptune is packing with two brains and three cards. Probably nothing. That's my guess. Another smoke. The smoke bomb was a waste of a card, you know. I mean, <coughs> not a total waste, but wow. We're making a lot of. Where is the dragon? That's all we need right now. Give this man the dragon. And we're doing fine. So we have the full block meter in 9, as opposed to our opponent who has the empty block meter in 10. And Great Zucchini is just fine here. That'll be good to count to the plank walker next turn. Or it's not even next turn, it's like. I love dragons. Let's keep this going. Banana's not bad there. That's good. I don't know what kind of tricks. Probably not much, but <laughs> he's bouncing that one. Why, man? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Great. Now we can stick something behind here. Okay. Fireworks zombie. Firefighter. I mean, once again, not getting it done. Not getting it done at all. Ah, wait, yes, Top Deck Dragon Madness. I love the dragon. The dragon is so good. Here's this. Uh, uh, wonder if the dragon's better here. Yeah, it is. It definitely is. This will be more shots. More shots. <laughs> Smoke bomb denied. Doesn't matter. This firefighter matters not. Oh, we can play an environment. Okay, good. The dragon does not affect environments. That is what your opponent can do, even despite the dragon. Uh, this is so guaranteed lethal. Octopult is already played. There's nothing that can prevent this from Neptuna. Gravestone and um, Frenzy. <laughs> He's Gravestone in this one. Yay! Go, dragon! Get it right in the face! Eight and zero. <laughs> I haven't lost a game on stream in about <laughs> in about three. This is like three full streams that we've gone 10 and 0, 10 and 0, and today's 8 and 0. Do we have time for? Uh, I think I'm gonna hold it here. We're out of time. These games take a long time. The ramp decks they really is very very late game. So well, I think I'm happy with 8 and 0. Let's do some PvP.